Mr. Liberadzki, if uh, you were to give advice to a European company or maybe a Polish company looking to uh, make money to do business in the Ukrainian energy sector that is being reformed, many privatizations coming up, many opportunities, but what would be the advice that you would give these European companies? Heard advice, go to Ukraine. Why? Because Ukraine is a country of tremendous opportunities not yet taken. Ukraine is a country where you have demand and be, if you make a proper efforts, you'll be able to supply and earning money. In Ukraine, you'll be having a people of increasing income, where it's not also about, where you consume more energy and you'll get sooner or later, but I do believe sooner, new energy sources, including biomasses. So go to Ukraine, take an opportunity, be present in the market, and finally take a look. It's a chance to include Ukrainian electricity system into European. Such experiences already we have between Poland and Ukraine. Looking at the Ukraine from this end of Europe, uh, we're mostly seeing it as a transit country for oil and gas from Russia, but you're seeing also opportunities in the Ukrainian energy sector itself. Can you elaborate a bit on that? I see the changes which are ongoing in Ukraine. I mean, efforts of government to limit uh, this all distortions we had, first of all, briberies. The second, I see economic reforms being implemented. Ukraine is getting more and more normal. Taxation system, first, uh, pension system, second, plus we have hundreds of thousands of Ukrainians who are coming back from Spain, Portugal, also from from Poland because of crisis in our part of Europe, but they are bringing new customs, new habits, they have new expectations. So don't worry, government seems to be trusty, procedures are being more and more transparent and also gain potential and location between Russia, European Union, but very close also is to Turkey. I saw very high interest of Turkey in cooperation with Ukraine. Ukraine as a country in terms of territory, slightly more than France, in terms of population, more than Poland. Good place. When it comes to transparency, you're, you're saying that steps are being taken already, but at the workshop it became clear that Ukraine still has a long way to go, especially compared to Poland. What concretely would you like to see in terms of action by the Ukrainian government to increase that transparency? First, to apply procedures. And what we had uh, got as a message today, the bidding procedures has been announced. There is a special committee which will be taking uh, all assessments. You know, still be cautious. Why it is a process? Because between having a law and following a law, introducing good, good practices and making declarations of introduction of good practices, time is necessary. Sorry to say, but maybe some hundreds or thousands of people who have to be in prison again. But if you are on a track, it takes time, but results will be for sure. Mr. Lebrowski, thanks very much. Thank you.